becoming more and more difficult to remember a time when this beautiful valley wasn't covered in a cloud of smoke. So the question is, how is this smoke affecting people's summer and also their health? Yeah, well, we really wanted to go out on the boat and it's not going to be as nice on the water with the smoke, but I guess it's part of life. Well, visually it's impairing, <laughs> but other than that, it hasn't affected me much. <laughs> well, I don't like it. It doesn't look good. <laughs> it doesn't affect me personally. Uh, you know, it's not too bad. Um, just get on the lungs, obviously not so much, but um, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not too bad. It's manageable. Yeah, actually it is. It's quite hazy and uh, creating a raspy throat. Um, can't really breathe well, wheezy, hot, sweaty. <laughs> I'm a local resident, so uh, I've just uh, been keeping keeping inside as much as I can, and uh, yeah, avoiding uh, avoiding the smoke. It seems to be getting worse and worse, uh, but hopefully it'll clear off soon. I cough more and sneeze, <laughs> and it's kind of gloomy, but otherwise, it's not too bad, I guess. <laughs> um, it hasn't really affected my health, but um, I, you know, I, I like to cycle two, three times a week. And I've been getting out maybe once a week just because the warning's over the smoke. But um, other than that, I mean, it's just it's a little depressing. It feels a little like, like Armageddon. Get Castanet's mobile app, available now on iTunes and Google Play.